might remember this. A brave, first-of-its-kind move that took place at Martinsville Speedway last fall was remembered today. 10 Sports reporter Eric Johnson has more on why part of the wall was preserved at the historic venue. Desperate times call for desperate measures, and when you have the chance to compete for a NASCAR championship, you do whatever it takes. That's what Ross Chastain did here at Martinsville Speedway back in October. Needing to finish ahead of Denny Hamlin, he pinned his car against the wall starting in turn three, all the way through turn four. All gas, no brakes, pulling off a video game-like move that will forever be etched in history. About halfway, I just remember just letting go of the wheel because I didn't know what was going to happen. And I thought I made it this far. Now if it happens, it might be really bad. So I let go and immediately the, the forces, like this, the G-forces just pulled my arms. There's been so much history here in, in 76 years. Uh, and to add that to everything that's happened prior to that point is phenomenal. I mean, as I said, there's nothing you could, nothing that we can compare that move to. Nothing like that has ever happened here. It's just amazing how many great drivers have raced here, how many races they've had here over the years, and uh, I'm proud that we were able to be a, a piece of something special. NASCAR has since pumped the brakes on Chastain's move, citing a rule the risks posed to not only the spectators, but also the other drivers on the track. As for that piece of wall that was removed, it will forever live on, whether here at the Martinsville Speedway or possibly at the NASCAR Hall of Fame. Ross Chastain has certainly left his mark here at the paperclip. At Martinsville Speedway, Eric Johnson, 10 Sports.